Okay, recording hydraulic lifters on a 3800. I did a tear down on the engine and I thought, well, I'll take these apart. Haven't seen anything on the internet about using these tools. Well, maybe this one. This is to pull the lifters out of their bores. This piece fits in here like this. Goes down and then you tighten this in and it expands this collet. It grips them. Then you use this to slide hammer them out of the bore. Works very good for sticky, sticky lifters. You know, stuck in their bores. Comes out like that. There's a, there's a uh, uh, ball bearing in there that expands this piece and it grabs this. So that works pretty good. All right, on there. Now, also to get this out, this is this is the uh, this is a lifter apart. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine pieces total. What you do is you pull this clip off here with a, with a sharp tool like this, and it comes apart. I don't want to get all these parts apart because I, you want to try to keep them in their respective bores, but. Uh, this collet off in this slide hammer, I bought it off on Amazon and it was uh, I think 71 bucks plus shipping a year ago and I did it on a GM uh, 3100. I had, I changed the head gaskets and the uh, lower intake manifold gaskets. I thought while I was in there, I'd pull the lifters apart and see how they look because it had a, like a lifter type noise. Um, it, it, it did help them. They were a little dirty, but they weren't gummed up like this 3800. But uh, in order to get this apart, what this does is it fits down in here. Once you get these three pieces off here, and this is stuck in here, it'll be a son of a bitch getting out of there. So you stick that in here like this. Get this in here. It fits in there, and then you tighten this down and expands that collet expands that collet and then you can slide hammer this piece out of here because it's a real tight fit. You hold this and you just go like this. Just like that. It comes right out. It works sweet. You know, it's worth it. I mean, I've seen guys banging on them. I tried doing that. It's like, you talk about frustrating. It's very frustrating. Hopefully I can get this. Hopefully this will uh, show up good there. But yeah, this is a 10 millimeter collet, and what it does is it, is it expands when you put when you screw this down. It this here goes inside there and pushes on there, and it flares those out, and that's how it grabs that. Does very good. You know, like I said, I've never seen anybody else use this. I think one guy referenced using them, but he never showed it or he just talked about it in brief in passing. But uh, that's the biz, man. And uh, these were really, really dirty. Um, I cleaned them up with uh, brake clean. Then I used, uh, I think it was lacquer thinner. And then uh, I also used Scratch Bright to clean up the outer part of the outer part and inner part because they were they were quite grungy. So they, the engine wasn't making any lifter noise, but um, I did a, a, a video on the oil pump a week or so ago, and I thought, well, I got this down, I might as well show this. So it work, works pretty good. So it's a lot easier taking apart than uh, trying to bang on them. So I hope this works for you guys.